Alrighty, I'm just going to show you my shelf where I have all of the keto stuff. Hold on. Yeah, I was going to show you my keto shelf. I just came back from Aldi's and I was really excited to go in there, but they still didn't get the bread in there. Um, but I've heard through a couple of people, Keto Connect and another um, person that does keto, that they have a lot of keto stuff in there. But they finally found some Keto Connect. They found bread. I didn't see any. But anyways, I got these from Aldi. I got me some raw cashew walnuts and macadamia nuts. These are good for a snack, just sparingly. And I got this um, dark chocolate. And I got these... I've never seen anybody eat the Slim Jims, but I always liked <laughs> Didn't do me any harm. And I found whey protein. Um, it's chocolate. They didn't have any other flavor, and I would rather have a different flavor, but chocolate's fine. I like something like maybe blueberry or a chocolate chip or vanilla, um, strawberry. But maybe next time I'll get a, they'll have a different flavor. I'll check next time. Okay, um, and I also got some almond butter, and I got ghee. Is that all I got out of there? Oh, no, I got these two things. It, it wasn't very, it was getting ready to close, so I couldn't really take very long looking around, so I'll go over there tomorrow probably. And I got these Parmesan crisps. And uh, these are cheddar, and these are the original. Um, and I got a olive oil. And this was like 38 bucks for all of this stuff. Um, I saw some cookies, which they were keto, and I heard a bad review on them, so I didn't get them. But I might have different taste buds, so maybe I should have just gotten them anyways. But anyways... Um, We'll see. But anyways, I heard that the uh, nut butter is good. This one's almond. And it's probably less. Uh, but you can have that as a fat bomb, it says, with maybe a little dark chocolate for a little dessert. A couple of these squares out of the candy, dark chocolate. Um, I'll keep checking and researching and seeing if I'm having the best brands. If I'm not, then... I think uh, this is probably has sugar in it. And I think the other kind is something else. I'm not sure, but we'll see what kind of dark chocolate is good for the keto. And that's the one I got. So anyways, I was excited to show you guys. I am getting myself together here. And I have a shelf full of things. I have stevia, truvia, a little bit of truvia left. I use most of that coconut flour. Um, almond flour. I'm almost out of almond flour. I have to get some more. But I didn't check the flowers. I didn't have time because they were closing. Unsweetened coconut flakes. Xanthan gum. I like coconut flakes, even if they don't have sugar. It's just good. It's my favorite. Because it doesn't taste sweet when you eat it out of the coconut, so you can eat it like that, right? Uh, and this is the brown almond flour, and I've got flaxseed back there. Okay, so this is my keto shelf here. Everything keto is going to be up here. Okay. Alright, so. I will talk to you all a little later. And I really appreciate all my subscribers. Thank you guys for subscribing. And thank you for your questions. And for your comments. The beautiful comments and your likes. I really appreciate it. And I'm on my road to. Staying on the keto um, again, and I really enjoyed it last time. And I felt like this morning I got up and I was like, hmm, I'm hungry. <laughs> so it's a familiar feeling, but you get up and you make your salad or you make your eggs and um, protein, your eggs and whatever kind of meat. Or I'm looking for that keto bread, and I probably will make some because that's why I got the flaxseed. And I'm looking for the other ingredients for and the xanthan gum for this bread that I saw. So I'll keep, I do have xanthan gum, 
right here. Um, I need some other things, but I've got a, a start here and I just haven't been able to really do shopping today. I went kind of late and the store was closing. Aldi's closes at nine over here. And so we got there about quarter till. <laughs> so I did pretty good right here with this little bunch. And I will show you what I make out of some of these things, but, um, I haven't really got ingredients for a meal yet, but except the bread, I have a bread maker. I'm really going to make the bread in there. And I'm excited because I remember these, uh, times whenever I was doing keto before and I did it for a whole year and I enjoyed it and it just kind of got thrown off when we, these circumstances, um, Anyways, yeah, when we get started, they started putting us inside for the uh, um, the COVID. And I was like, get rice, you know, get rice because that's, they were making it seem like we're not going to have enough food and stuff. So we we're just eating things. And, you know, I don't know if we could have found keto stuff, but I should have checked better. Anyways, I'm going for the berries and things tomorrow and little uh, things like that for a sweet tooth. Um, I do have this chocolate, and um, I'm not sure if that's the right one, but I'll look online and on YouTube and see. If not, I'll get a different kind next time. So, anyways, thank you guys for your support, and I am enjoying watching other videos that have keto uh, suggestions, suggestions and recipes. I do have a lovely book here. It's Keto for Life which I cooked something out of there before and it didn't taste that great. So I'll try other things out of there. I can, you know, like maybe move them around and do different things with it. Um, so change different things that I, or for my taste buds and so forth. So anyways, you guys have a good evening and I will talk to you guys probably tomorrow. I have another video. So let me finish putting my shelf together up here. Take some of these nuts out of here and put them in little, a little container or something like that. These little teeny things that you get with a salad dressing in them. So you can only have a few of them at a time. Anyways, uh, I will talk to you in the next video, guys. And uh, have a good evening and uh, stay safe out there. Keep the masks on. Even if it feels like everybody's taking them off. You know, do it for yourself. If you feel fine, you know, do it for yourself. If you don't feel fine, don't worry about it. Um, you know, what anybody thinks. Okay. Have a good day and talk to you soon.